they sold them as a Chevrolet SS here. Okay. I just changed the bow ties out to honor the Australian makers that made the car. So. Yeah, I saw an SS the other day. Yeah. And I was like, it looks like a but I wasn't sure. Same car. <laughs> some did the conversion, some did not. So. Okay. Yeah. Thanks, man. Guess what guys, the rattle is gone. The rattle typically appears now between 1200 and 1350 RPM guesstimation, especially going up a hill in my neighborhood. The rattle is gone. I read somewhere in the forums that American Racing Headers told a customer one time with a similar symptom of rattling at certain RPMs to check the clamps because the entire clamp must cover as much of those openings in the joints in the or the indentations whatever you call them so that it is secured properly it's not unusual for aftermarket exhaust components to come loose after all the heat the movements and the elements so it's important to inspect it from time to time and tighten things up when I went under the car to so check out this photo, it was one of the clamps towards the back of the car was not completely covering those indentations. All I did was take a 5 8 uh, deep socket, loosened it up, and they're pretty loose. I can't find exact torque specs. So if you know the actual torque specs for the exhaust clamps, Drop a comment below. I mean, there's plenty of information on the header bolts, but anyway, that's off the subject. I just loosened the clamp, shifted it a little bit, moved it forward so, or moved it towards the front of the car, more so, so it's covering those lines and went for a drive just now, like you guys heard or didn't hear, there was no rattle anymore. There's a new concern now though. When I loosened the clamp, I felt the pipe separate slightly maybe by almost a quarter of an inch. So I tried my best to force them back closer together to close them that gap. Maybe now that gap, as you can see, is probably maybe about a quarter of an inch um, from that, um, that lip there. So I will keep an eye and an ear out for that. <laughs> um, I just didn't have the leverage under the car. I really wish I had a lift of some kind. So until then, I just gotta keep listening for any other other problems. So guys, until the next rattling noise, we will see you on the next video. Take care.